Good morning, happy Friday, y'all. Um, it is 10 o'clock. I still have time to do the 5K on the rowing machine, which I will do after I um, take care of some stuff. Okay, so this is all out. Why is this all out? Why? Because we got a new fridge. Look at that. Um, a brand spanking new. I gotta put everything back in there. I will fix the temp here in a second. I'm just trying to get it a little bit cooler. Um, so I just gotta take some stuff out. I put the milk in there to measure because that was down low, probably right there. Well, lower than that. And then that one was slightly above that. And we always put the the milk um, and the taller stuff right there. So we lost our butter drawer from the other one, but um, we got a new fridge. The other one has been here for like eight and a half years now. So, and it was leaking. I don't know why I did warn the guys beforehand that it leaked. I am also washing clothes. I am going to get everything put away in here and then eat something and then clear space out for the rowing machine. I am planning on doing the 2024 Memorial Day um, virtual race because it is uh, Memorial Day weekend. I guess this was there to keep to prevent it from sliding. So um, I'm washing laundry too i am hoping and this one doesn't even have the handles so i'm gonna put that back right there i would it would be nice if that went all the way down so but anyways i am going to go put stuff back into the fridge starting with this stuff right here all the milk and stuff um so it probably took me about 15 ish minutes to get everything out of the fridge and on top from on top so good start to our friday um we had the um time slot between like they gave us between nine and two and then they changed it between nine and one and then they called my mom and said we we're number three so 9 15 they call and they're like we're about 10 minutes away so they were in and out, like they took the old fridge out um, and then brought this one in, plugged it in. So, um, oh, there's a little glue spot right there. So, um, I don't know if, I think it's about the same size, but I will be back. So. Good morning, YouTube. Happy Friday. It is like almost 11.30 here. Um, we have our new fridge. <laughs> um, so, it, it was delivered about 9.30 this morning. We were on the list between 9 and 1. And my mom got a call this morning that we were third in line. Um... So, and then about 9.15, the guy called me and I was like, we're, we're 10 minutes out. I think it took him like 15 minutes to get here. Um, but I was getting everything out when I decided to wait because I didn't know what time they were coming. I decided to wait until um, they called me to let me know that they were on their way to get everything off of it, everything out of it. Um, so it's here. I'm waiting for it to cool. Well, I got everything back in there. So, huh, yeah. <laughs> Not everything went back in. The popsicles and there's two ice cream bars that didn't go make it back in and two loaves of frozen bread dough. So I just put the, the frozen bread dough that was thawing out in bread pans. So, We'll see what happens with them. Um, 
by like five o'clock and I'll just throw them in the oven until they're done. So we may have breadsticks or we may have an entire bread loaf. <laughs> Whatever. Um, so um, I FaceTimed my mom this morning and she's like, don't tell Wyatt. Let's see how long it takes him to notice it. Wyatt knows that we are getting a new fridge. Um, but we'll see how long. It's white like the other one. It doesn't have door handles. And the other one had a little thing that we used for our butter. And this one doesn't have it. So, whatever. Um, <laughs> it's nice. Um, it's a Frigidaire. Got as many of the as much as the stuff out. I tried to put everything back in the way it was. I had to rearrange a couple of shelves and everything is back in there with the exception of those two things. Um, I am drinking my pre-workout. Um, I got Wyatt's clothes in the washer. Um, I'll take those out as soon as we're done. We're doing this one. So, I'm going to keep this bag in with the rest of them. And we're doing the 2024 Memorial Day race. Um, it is Memorial Day weekend. So, always remember, never forget. Um, we don't know them all, but we owe them all. Happy Memorial Day. Remember and honor. So, these are the stickers. I'll use this one whenever I am done for, like, the front. Doing a 5K. Um, so I don't know how long it's going to take me to do the 5K. Um, so... <laughs> I am hoping to get it around 30 minutes again today, this time. Um, so, but we, we shall see. Um, so, I think, I think my pre-workout is losing the effectiveness, um, and I may have to, um, next time, well, in July, I should say, because this last, last time I am planning on getting the, the rowing machine out, I'm not going to stress about getting it out next week, because it's half days, the ki mom and the kids are off on Monday for Memorial Day, and then Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday are half days, Thursday's the last day, Elijah has an appointment on Friday for neurology, for his migraines. Um, Thursday's the last day of school. Wednesday, Elijah has his 8th grade awards thing. Um, he hasn't been to school since, like, Tuesday. Because he's done with everything. Um, so, um... <laughs> That's at 8.30, and then he'll just come back home with me. Um, what else? Why he gets done school at 11.25 next week, so, I don't know. Um, what else? And then the kids are off starting on Friday, um until July 22nd so I will sit down and figure out July August and September I know September um oh it's kicking in I can feel it right there stop sending me stuff for Timu um I know September is my birthday month, so I have three um, birthday races that I'm going to do in September. There is 2021, 2022, and 2023. So I'm going to do those the weeks leading up to my birthday. Um, I know the kids go on... Um, 
um, fall break at the end of September, like right after my birthday, in, in the first two weeks of October. Then October, I'm thinking about doing the Day of the Dead. Um, but I'm going to do probably... The, um, in July, I'm going to do the two 4th of July ones, but I'll, I'll go do a video and plan, um, everything out. Um, either do a video or go live because I have something coming up, which I will announce later. People in my group know, my group knows already. I have not made it internet public yet not completely internet public yet like not YouTube public <laughs> so I have um, um, mentioned it on in a couple of groups one being mine um, so I discovered yesterday that my one doctor is retiring. The one and only doctor I see every year is retiring at, on Friday. Friday is his last day. And, um, and my appointment is in November. And I was like, we had this talk before. I was like, you're not allowed to retire, quit, move, anything. It's like, yeah, that video is disgusting. Um, so, and him and the other guy that, um, is retiring too on Friday. So, it's like, why, yeah. I don't know who to go to <laughs> now, so, um, him and the other one are the two who did my C-section, so, somebody said, oh, they'll begin calling at the beginning of June, um, so, I am not thrilled that my doctor is retiring. He has the audacity to retire before the end of the year. Before my appointment, the audacity of this guy. <sighs> Anyways, um, I'm going to go since my pre-workout is kind of starting to work. So, anyways, I'm almost done with that that can, and then I'll open up the new one in October or um August. So, anyways, I'll be back. Okay, taking a break, quick break. Um, got over two kilometers, got two miles left. We're doing um about a ten twenty two ish a minute. Mile. Huh. I don't know. I'm just kind of not feeling it today, but we're gonna get it done. Then once I am done, I'm a shower, and then probably go get Wyatt from school between 1:30 and 2. He gets done at 2 o'clock. I don't know. My, I just feel kind of sluggish. I'm going to make an appointment for me to get my hormones checked. My hormonies. <laughs> from a big fat Greek wedding. So, um, but anyways, and I'm also going to eat some lunch too. So, I don't know. We'll see. But I'll be back. Okay, another break time. Less than a mile left to go. So, mile two is about ten or so minutes. About the same as the last one. <coughs> so, I did take a potty break. Um, a drink break. And a small food break. Feeling slightly better. But, I got my shorts on. Stuff like that. 
um, got the fan going. So, I'm currently in fat burning mode. Um, so, heart rate's going 121, 122, to that type of thing. Um, I don't know how accurate my Fitbit is, but, um, so... Almost done. I got less than a mile left. So, I'll see you when I see you at the end when I'm done. Okay, so I shaved 11 seconds off my previous time. So, second best. Woohoo! We're done. Um, so, it's like 12.30. <laughs> Um, yeah. <sighs> Definitely eat and shower or do like a post-workout protein shake. Oh, I gotta stop my pity bit. Okay, and that. Of course, I just let it go. So, Fitbit says it took me longer, but I didn't pause it during breaks. And I started it later, like after <laughs> the first mile. My bad. Oh well. Um, I'll go by that time rate there, thirty-one forty-nine. No, mark it down there and there. Mark it down on all three. So, anyways. Okay, so I decided to make it myself a post-workout protein shake with a organ protein powder. And the organ collagen peptides. I'm trying to finish that one up. So, and then while I was shaking the bottle, um, so, um, <laughs> and like I don't trust the shaker blender bottle thingies, especially with the with the caps that flip over open, um. And it got all over my shirt, which is why I am in a different shirt. Decided to take a shower, okay, a much needed shower. Um, so, finished my, my post-workout shake, showered. I'm going to finish up the video, take some pictures. Is 1.35. I do walk with me. <sighs> Doing something a little cray-cray. Um, <laughs> running the, um, self-cleaning option on the washer, and I still have White's clothes in there, so he's had some accidents, um, so we're seeing if the, that makes it any better with his clothes so i am all caught up with my things um uh, my tracking stuff so oh, i really like this like every mile matters see okay Turn around. Nope. I gotta put it like this. So I'm a uh, um get this stuff done. Um, I will probably sit and because I do have to leave here shortly. Um, distance completed. 5k 3.10 miles it's l m i l a s <coughs> um finished time what did i say i finished in 3149 A date completed uh, 24-24. So, I will get out the thing 
the paper, the, the insert and sheet protector and put it, everything in the binder and I'm tired. <laughs> um, so I know I mentioned in an earlier clip about getting my hormones checked, my hormones. <laughs> um, I watched a live yesterday from, um, actually Gage Girl Training. She's the maker of Gage Life Stuff, my pre-workout, um, about hormones and stuff like that. If I could figure out how to link that video, um, so she listed some symptoms, um, and stuff like that, um, it was yesterday, the 23rd, that she did this, um, this live. Um, I've been thinking about getting my hormones, um, uh, no, not you, I need Gage. There we go, Gage Girl Training, so, um, the live, can you lose weight if your hormones are out of whack? It's a 40 minutes live, um, streamed yesterday, the 23rd. Um, there was one two days ago that I'm gonna watch. Um, how to get rid of cortisol belly. So, Um, but anyway, she listed a whole bunch of hormones to get tested when you go see the doctor. Um, she went too fast to message me, oh, Erica, about Timu. Um, hold on, I will get that for you. Um... In a second, I messaged her asking what hormones. Um, all right, uh, she recommends getting these hormones tested the estradiol, E S T R A D I O L, progesterone, testosterone, D E D H E A, cortisol, T H S, T3, T4, vitamin C, A1, C, and fasted blood glucose. So um, I'm going to write that down and take it in with me whenever I schedule an appointment. Um, so, um, I, I've just been, been feeling tired. Like, some of the, the things, like, unexplained weight gain. So, I gained probably, hold on, let me get my Fitbit out. Um, I've gained quite a few pounds. I've lost a little bit of that, I think. Um, and nothing has changed. I have been on the rowing machine doing, like, at least a, one of these a week. Um, for at least 12 weeks. 12 of the weeks so far this year. Um... Lost 15 pounds. Um, what have I gained so far this year? Um, okay, there is 10, 12 pounds, and I've lost two of those pounds. So, my, my weight keeps fluctuating. Um, I had lost, like, gained, what did I say, 12 pounds? Yeah, I've lo lost, or lost 15 pounds from my ov overall highest weight, and then I had, like, my lowest this year was 22 pounds down, um, hold on, nope, we're in November, I don't need November, I need January, um, 22, yeah, 22 pounds down, um, and then I gained 12 pounds, I've lost two, it keeps fluctuating, 
Um, so like my diet hasn't changed. I've been exercising. Um, I don't know if it's stress. I don't know if it's hormones. I'm exhausted. I got this belly. Um, so I don't know if it's stress. I don't know what it is. So I am going to make an appointment, um, and see if, um, I could get my hormones checked and stuff like that. It's a good idea anyways to get your hormones checked just to make sure you're, you're fine. Um, so I'm going to try to do that for the next upcoming weeks. I got to find the number to the, um, place, the doctor's office that I go to. Um, I don't know if a walk-in clinic would run hormones or anything like that. I guess I could try, but I really don't want to wait <laughs> around any longer than what I have to. Um, we'll see what is available where I go. I don't particularly like my, um, the, the place that I go. I'm looking for someplace better, but... Something needs to be done. I should not be getting six to seven hours of sleep and still be this exhausted or like have the weight gain that I have had. Like, it is driving me insane, y'all. So, but anyways, I'm going to take some pictures, probably grab something quick to eat. Um, so, I did this. This is the 2024, as you can see here. I did the 5K. Um, so... But I will keep you updated about doctor's appointments and stuff like that and what's going on. So, maybe, um, nah, it's been going on this year. I don't know. But anyways, I'm going to edit this video, uh, get a quick bite to eat, and then go get Wyatt. Um... From school, it's the weekend, so... I will see y'all tomorrow. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. That fly is getting on my nerves. Smash the bell like you would smash that fly that is flying around here. So, peace.